we've just been in the court, um, the British National Party being taken to court by the Commission for Equalities and Human Rights using British taxpayers' money to have a go at an organisation that sticks up for the British people. Uh, the British National Party asked for an adjournment so that they could um, get their evidence together. The judge has given us an adjournment and he quite rightly pointed out to the Commission who were trying to enforce during the adjournment that we don't accept any members in the interim period because they believe we are breaking the Race Relations Act. The judge quite rightly said, you know, why has it taken them 27 years? And he refused to grant uh, their wishes that we stop taking new members in the interim period. However, he did uh, award costs to the Commission, which is um, this graceful when you think that uh, they've got the benefit of uh, taxpayers' money, a bottomless pit of taxpayers' money, and, and our organisation relies on the donations of its members. So I was a bit disappointed about that, but very pleased that he pointed out that it's taken them 27 and a half years. For the members of our party, our supporters, the voters, and the general public in general, this sort of hearing should chill their blood, because there are many, many organisations in this country that uh, look out and support the welfare of ethnic people and yet because we generally look out for the interests of the indigenous people of these islands, although not solely, you know, our, our MEPs, our councillors up and down the country, um, they will look after any constituent that goes to them, but because principally we are an organisation for the indigenous people of these islands, we are being attacked um, using our taxpayers' money to try and close us down. The reason for that is because we've just moved up into the big league as regards uh, elections, two MEPs, a London Assembly member. You know, we're, we're on our way and we're going to fight this all the way because it is a serious infringement of the rights of the British people.